We are going to react nitric acid with copper. Nitric acid is the inorganic compound with the formula HNO3. It is a highly corrosive mineral acid. The compound is colorless but all the samples tend to be yellow cast due to decomposition into oxides of nitrogen. Most commercially available nitric acid has a concentration of 68% in water. When the solution contains more than 86% HNO3, it is referred to as fuming nitric acid. Depending on the amount of nitrogen dioxide present, fuming nitric acid is further characterized as red fuming nitric acid at concentrations above 86% or white fuming nitric acid at concentrations above 95%. Copper is a chemical element with the symbol Cu, and Latin name Cuprum, and atomic number 29. It is a soft, malleable, and ductile metal with very high thermal and electrical conductivity. Copper is a reddish-brown metal, widely used in plumbing and electrical wiring. And now we're finally going to start this reaction. Copper is oxidized by concentrated nitric acid HNO3 to produce Cu2 plus ions. The nitric acid is reduced to nitrogen dioxide, a poisonous brown gas with an irritating odor. When the copper is first oxidized, the solution is very concentrated and the Cu2 plus product is initially coordinated to nitrate ions from the nitric acid, giving the solution first a green and then a greenish brownish color. In the reaction between copper and nitric acid, nitric oxide gas is produced, which is brownie vapor poison gas. Nitric acid is a very strong oxidizing agent, and the copper is oxidized to copper ions and the solution turns from colorless to red. And a cloud of red toxic gas of nitric oxide as evolves and hence whole copper is consumed in the reaction. The reaction of copper with nitric acid takes place in two stages. At the first stage, the acid oxidizes the copper to copper oxide, releasing nitrogen dioxide. At the second stage, copper oxide reacts with new portions of acid, forming copper nitrate. The mixture heats up and the reaction accelerates. The result is that the metal dissolves and a solution of copper nitrate forms. The copper nitrate gives the solution a green or blue color. This will depend on the amount of water used.